Our processing system is the set of process to complete the tasks and activities that related to the collection, packaging and delivery of packaged goods. Okay. Order processing is used for to make it more systematic and easy to check out. And second, insight for business users. Third, customer service platform. Next, the problem was faced by the customer of Susina Gumila Enterprise. The problem issue is Susina Gumila Enterprise doesn't have a proper in their order processing system. We get 44 of the respondent or customer that have a problem in getting their desired product. Next, we get 29.4% have a problem in making an order and make purchases. Next, we get 11.8% um, have a problem in getting feedback from Susina Gumila Enterprise. So that at last we get 100% of respondent was agree with Susina Gumila Enterprise to develop a website to enhance their order processing system. General objective to develop a website as a new platform of order processing system for Susina Gumila Enterprise. Specific objective have a three. Number one, to identify the problems the face by the Susina Gumila Enterprise using the manual ordering systems. Number two, to compare between manual and new ordering system for Susina Gaming Enterprise and number three to measure the effective of new ordering system for Susina Gaming Enterprise the scope of this project will be explored about a business that have a problem with their ordering processing system duration of this project in start March 2021 and will be complete in June 2021. This project is located at Nombor 18 Jalan Malati 3-17 Bandar Malawati 45000 Kuala Selangor, Selangor Darul Ehsan. Next, the idea to improve the order processing by creating a website for Susina Gemila Enterprise. This project will focus on to the customer of Susina Gemila Enterprise. I am going to present about limitation of business project. Limitation. There are three limitations. Firstly, difficulties to meet with teammates due to COVID-19 pandemic, unable to meet to make decision or gather data. Secondly, limited access to data due to movement order control as lead to difficulty to meet face to face the owner of Susina Gambilang Enterprise to get information as fast as could. Thirdly, time constraints. Limited time to study and complete the project and project need to be complete in month of June. June. Organizational background. Su Sina Gamilang Enterprise established on 10 September 2002 and located at No 18 Jalan 317 Banda Malawati 45000 Kuala Selangor, Selangor Darul Ehsan. Su Sina Gamilang Enterprise registered with Surahanjaya Sharikat Indonesia and established to enter into the field of retail entrepreneurship. Su Sina Gamilang Enterprise owned by Susilawati Binti Samsudin. Today I'm going to explain about SU Sina Gamilang Enterprise organization chart. As shown on the slide, this is organization chart for SU Sina Gamilang Enterprise. At the top is Puan Susilawati Binti Samsudin as manager at SU Sinagilang Enterprise. Under Puan Susilawati is Encik Musia bin Abdul Hamid as supervisor for SU Sinagilang Enterprise. Under the supervisor from bottom left is Sayyidatul Azmina Binti Muslihab as management department in charge. On right side is Nur Farahin Binti Abdul Razak as in charge of production department. Product and services that provide by SU Sina Gemilang Enterprise. The product offered by SU Sina Gemilang Enterprise is bakery products such as cakes and dessert, traditional cakes, and baking ingredients. As shown on the slide, as an example, at the cake part, we got black fondant cakes and cakes. At bread and kuih, we got roti bengali and kuih bahulu. At baking ingredients, we got chocolate for baking purpose and cream cheese. 
that all are some example of product in SU Sina Gemilang Enterprise. Many more some delicious foods and baking ingredients at their shop. And I'm here to talk about SWOT analysis. I'm going to go out with strengths. The first point is consistency and quality of product, which means Sinagamilang business is consistent and they are very rich with the quality of the products. Next off is an affordable price. They always run their business with an affordable price. They also provide baking class in case the customers or anyone else wants to learn or interest in baking. Next off, I'm going to go out with weakness. One of the weakness Sinagamilang has is manual ordering system. They are also lack in terms of marketing. When we come to see in the opportunities, they have taste and preference acceptance in baking. They also have movement order control by government. One of the threats that Sina Gamilang has is new competitors, which means they have new competitors in order to compete in their business. And also due to COVID-19 pandemic, they are unable to run their business and get profit like before. going to go with 5C analysis. In 5C analysis, we have customer, competitors, climate, collaborators, and also company. I'm going to start off with company. The company vision is to become a well-known bakery with a well-tracked traffic location, a long-term employees, and also long-term customers, which can give them profit. Next off, I'm going to go with customers. SU Sina Gamilang serves over 100 customers every single day and the customer satisfaction is very important to them. Next off, collaborators. They collaborate with few suppliers. Example, Up Maori Malaysia SD and BHD, Lucky Frozen SD and BHD, HNZ Bake Enterprise and also Juicing Enterprise. Next, competitors. Mere competitors to SU Sinaga Milang are Suzy Bakery and also Baker's Cottage. They have two fly sales bakery ingredients as well. Lastly, I'm going to go off with Climate. According to the Climate, they have a strategic location, they have friendly staffs as well, and they do have delicious and variety types of products. Today, I, will, I am going to present about the methodology used in this project. There are four methodologies used in this project, which is research design, sampling design, data collection method, and data analysis method. For research design, we have used qualitative research, quantitative research. For qualitative research, we have done an online interview with the owner of Susnar Gemina Enterprise. While for quantitative research, we have distributed an online survey to the customer of Susina Gemilang Enterprise. For sampling design, we have identified the target population, select the sampling frame, choose sampling technique, determine sample size, collect the data, and assess the response rate. For data collection method, we have used two types of method, which is online interview and online survey. Lastly, data analysis method. To analyze the data of the customer, we have used a descriptive analysis method, the data has been summarized in the form of percentage. And the solution. To solve the problem of Susinar Gemilang Enterprise, we have created a solution by developing a website as a new order processing system. As shown as the next figure is the homepage of Susinar Gemilang Enterprise website. The, through this website, there are four main pages which is about cake, bread and cookies, baking ingredients, and contact. To make purchases or order, customer can click add to chart of any product and check out at the checkout section. Customers can choose either to make a payment through online banking or cash on the delivery. After completed the purchases, customer will automatically receive a confirmation order through email as shown as this figure. The effectiveness of this website has been measured by distribute a post survey to the customer of Susinar Gemila Enterprise. According to the survey, 100% of the customer will agree that the development of the website have a lot in making an order or purchases at Susinar Gemilang Enterprise. 
97.1% of them also agree that it is easier to get information related to the product stock with the existence of the website. Furthermore, 91.4% also agree that the, the website effect in making order and getting a fast feedback from Susinar Gemila Enterprise. Last but not least, 97.1% will agree that it is easier to use website than manual ordering system. The main purpose of this project was relied by creating a website as a new uh, order processing system for Susunang Gemilang Enterprise. Susunang Gemilang Enterprise order management and customer satisfaction will improve following the completion of this project. The creation of new order process software can save time and effort by automating invoice based on payment terms and billing process such as project based and recurring billing. Enhance the notification so that the customer may receive notification through website, SMS or elsewhere. Do study on various enterprise in addition to the bakery industry.